Hello and welcome, it's Richard Huntley here and if you are new to my videos you can now pick up a copy of my 7 day fat loss formula plan for free by clicking on the link here in the video or the links below this video to get started right now. Hey guys, Richard Huntley here back with another video just for you. Another great standing ab workout. This one can be done anywhere at home or at the gym, wherever you want. It only needs a little space because you're standing up when you're doing it. Really good one to do. So I'm going to combine the exercises together. Watch this one because the last standing ab workout, if you haven't seen it yet on my YouTube channel, make sure you go and have a look because it's a good one. This one can be one that can incorporate, you could go that exercise that I showed before in a recent video and then this one as well. So you can combine them together to make an ultimate great standing ab workout. So. This time, this is what's going to happen. We're going to do a lunge forward here like this. When, as you come down, you're going to go a forward kick. Boom. If you want also, once you come down, boom, and you're going to do two punches, and then you're going to go back down, kick, two punches here. Back down, kick, two punches. So we're working all of the areas. If, it, if I break it down so you understand, as we're coming down here, we're going to push forward, so this is using the mid stabilizers. Once I've done my kick here like this, you're then going to hold your foot back. It doesn't need to go right back into a lunge position. Just hold this position, it's fine. Now you're going to work onto the obliques, onto the sides. So you're really going to twist, you're going to fire. If you see some of the martial artist abs in the world, like Bruce Lee and that, they had some of the best abs because they did all sorts of strikes and different bodyweight exercises. They were martial artists, so they have some really solid abs. So you've got to learn from these guys. That's why I love it personally myself. So you come here like this, you're going to lunge down, you're going to do a front kick out, you're going to do two side twists, then you can swap sides, you can lunge kick it down, boom, and then fire like this. It's going to get your heart rate up, you can have a little movement with it, get fun, get your friends involved, and then uh, all together we'll have a real great workout, and it's a perfect standing ab workout for you to try at home. See you next time in the next video. Hi, Richard Huntley here, and today's workout we're going to be looking at how to get rid of that stubborn back fat with this combination exercise. You're going to love it. There's three points to this exercise, so make sure you watch carefully each and every one of them. I'm going to break it down step by step so you understand how you can go and use it straight today for the rest of this week. Start bringing this exercise into your life. It's good for the entire body, but it's going to help you lose your back fat as well. So here's the first setup point. First of all, we're going to do a sumo squat. All this is regular squats, more shoulder width apart. This one, we slightly turn the heels in, so feet's going slightly outwards, and it's a little bit wider as well. So we just come down here like this direction. Okay, so as we come down here in a sumo squat, we're going to push through, and as we come up, we are going to lean to one side and then you're going to kick your foot out. If you've got ornaments around you and things at home, please go careful. I don't want to get the blame for you kicking over one of your parents or whoever you're living with's favourite ornament, okay? Look around you, make sure everything's all okay. Just before we get started. So here, lean to one side, fire a side kick out. Bang, there. Then back down here, just like a sumo wrestler similar does. Fire down. The third part is where we use the entire body. Hand down to burpee sumo squat, there, and then we're going to come back up keeping the sumo squat. So you're keeping it wide all the time. Good for the inner thighs as well, but big calorie burn, going to lose the back fat as well. So we're going to, here's the setup, this is what it's going to look like now. So we're going to go one, bang, two, down, bang, this way, hands down, fast feet, back up here into position, one. And then we can come down with the squat if you want. Then you can push back, you see? So it's a very full body exercise, as you can see. Flexibility on the legs from left to right. Hands are popping down for stability. Firing your legs back just as fast as they go up. You want to bring them back in as well. Keep your abs tight, core tight, everything tight. Then you're going to work your entire body throughout. That's what we're trying to work for here. My exercises, we're combining exercises together. And what this gives is your bigger calorie burn, not just in this workout, but through the entire day. And that's the key point, the take home point for today. In the description below this video or in the comment section, I'll put a little setup so you can write it down or put, up, put it on your phone so you can take it home. Do whatever you want with these workouts today. I'll show you the basic setup for them. I broke down the exercise. That's the three combo move. Sumo squat, two side kicks burpee fire back fast hope you enjoyed it let me know how you get on see you in the next video take care 
Hey guys, Richard Huntley here, and today we're going to have a little look at a short three minute ab workout. I'm going to combine the setup and show you exactly what you need to do to get set up for your three minute daily ab workout. These are great little finishers if you want to, or if you just want to maybe just try these three minutes a day, give this a go. It's fun, it's challenging, you can do it for your own fitness level to really challenge you for the best version of yourself. Now, Here's the setup for it. We're going to do one cardio exercise into one direct ab exercise. So this is what we're going to do. The first thing we're going to do is high knees with fast punches. So we're going to come up. You're going to go like this for 20 seconds. You can speed it up as well when you're going through. Once we've done our punches here and the knees for the 20 seconds, if you're on a timer, you've got the beep. You're then going to come down for 10 seconds and hold either a full size plank here like this or you're going to come down and hold the plank onto your elbows. Once you've done your 10 seconds here you're going to come straight back up for 20 seconds and then you're going to do the rapid punches again with the knees here and then you're going to pop back down static plank hold. 20 seconds to 10 seconds, 20 seconds to 10 seconds. You're going to repeat that over, let's do my maths, six times then you're going to get three minutes total for the workout. Great little combo workout for you to try at home. Hardly need any space. Enjoy it. See you in the next video. Take care for now. Hey guys, Richard Huntley here, and here's another new setup for a three minute ab workout. I will show you the setup for it so you can go and practice at home. I'll write in the comments or description below the exact setup, but I'll just show you in the video here so you understand. The first thing, 20 seconds on or full pace hand taps, which means you're touching underneath here. Every time you lift your knee, you've got to make sure no lazy habits, so none of this. You want to come touch every time. So you're going to go 20 seconds fast, fast like this. Okay, quick as you can while holding it in a safe manner. Once you've done your 20 seconds, the beeper's up. You're going to pop down here like this. You're going to place your hands place to the side here, knees up, and then you're going to push out and extend through for 10 seconds, firing here like this. If you can, you can go a little bit further down and you can stretch right up. Absolutely fine, until you get the ab strength and then you can push through here like this as well. Absolutely cool like that. Then you're gonna pop back up. You're gonna go for the 20 again. 20 of the hand taps as quick as you can. Back down, 10 seconds there. 20, 10, 20, 10, all the way through six whole repetition rounds of that, it's going to equal to your three minutes. Now if you want to go six, nine minutes, you just keep repeating them. Before you know it, if you're giving some actual effort involved within the time, that's what counts, because that's what I was always taught. It's not always how long you work out for, it's what you can do with your time. So you give me ten minutes and I can whip you into shape no problem. Where some people might work out for 45 minutes, but they're around the gym talking to people and not really getting much accomplished. So today, try that workout. Three minute ab workout you can do at home or anywhere. Hand taps to the snapdragon pushes with the legs out. Leg pushes are great for the abs too. One of uh, Bruce Lee's type of, exercise, type of exercises for his abs he absolutely loved. And uh, if it works for him, it can work for you too. See you in the next video. Have a great day. For more fitness, fat loss and motivational videos, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. To drop more fat this week, you can pick up a copy of my 7 day fat loss formula plan for free by clicking on the link here in the video or the link below these videos. Have a great day.